Congratulations on your purchase of the Best Aid Hearing Device. In this video, we'll explain how to use your Best Aid Hearing Device, charging your device, maintenance and cleaning, and answering common questions about your Best Aid Hearing Device. First, let's take a look at the Best Aid Hearing Device. This is the on and off control. N stands for power on. O is for power off. Turning the dial controls the volume of your Best Aid hearing device. Turn it clockwise to increase the volume, or to the right, and turn it counterclockwise to decrease, or turn it left. To use the Best Aid wireless hearing device, you attach the ear tip to the hearing device. Next, you turn on the device. And finally, gently place the device securely in your ear canal. Charging your device. Remember to turn the hearing device off before and during charging. Insert one end of the charger into the wall power adapter and the other end into the hearing device's charging port. Then, plug the charger into an electrical outlet to begin charging. While the device is charging, the LED light will glow red. Once the device has completed charging, the light will turn green. The first three times you charge your hearing device, it must charge for eight hours. After that, it will only need four to six hours to be fully charged. When fully charged, the hearing device should last up to 35 hours. Remember to only use the specified charger and battery exclusively designed for this hearing device. Maintenance and cleaning. Clean the hearing device and the earplugs with a clean, dry cloth after each use. Allow the hearing device to dry completely after cleaning and store it in a safe, dry and clean place. Do not submerge the hearing device underwater, as this can cause liquids to enter and damage the hearing device. And remember to turn off the hearing device when not in use. Do not wear the hearing device while bathing and showering or swimming. Do not expose the hearing device to extreme heat. Do not wear the hearing device while undergoing shortwave therapy or medical treatments that are subject to strong radio frequency or magnetic fields. Do not wear the hearing device in the vicinity of strong electromagnetic fields or x-rays. Protect the device from impacts, humidity, dirt, severe temperature fluctuations, and direct sunlight. Never dry your hearing device in the microwave. Clean and service your hearing device regularly. Ensure that no foreign objects are in between or blocking the air plug in the headphones as this could impair the sound. Now let's answer some common questions and concerns about your best aid hearing device. What do I do if no sound can be heard from the hearing device? Check to make sure the hearing device is properly switched on. Ensure the microphone is not blocked or dirty. And charge the battery as it may be low. Why is my device so quiet? The volume setting on the hearing device is too low. The battery is low. The earpiece is clogged or dirty. The microphone is clogged or dirty. Why is my hearing device whistling? The volume setting on the hearing device may be too high. The earplug is pressed too tightly against the microphone. Or Excess earwax needs to be cleaned from the device. We understand that using new hearing aids can be a stressful process. Remember that it's expected for your device to not feel normal for the first few weeks. Focus on using your hearing aids every day for a few weeks and you'll be acclimated to the device. And lastly, remember that our outstanding customer service team is more than happy to help if you have any problems at all. Just send us an email at support at bestaidhearing.com and we'll take care of you. Thank you again for being a Best Aid Hearing customer. We really appreciate your business and hope you love your new device.